All right, so good day everyone. Um, today I'm going to show you how to remove the Labor of Love strap uh, pre-wired solderless kit from the uh, mounted uh, plexiglass plate. So we received some feedback that uh, it's a little uh, difficult or challenging to remove the kit but um, today we're gonna clear that up with this uh, little video hopefully you can uh, do the same when you get yours okay so without further ado let's look at how we're gonna do it so you will receive the kit in this little box okay so in in the box you will have a pre white harness in the back like this and then you will also receive the output jack wired output jack and last but not least you will have um, some tools to assist you in the disassembly and reassembly into the pick guard so let's look at let's look at the tools that we have here so you will get a total of three tools together with this kit. All right. So so you have a micro minus screwdriver like this. Okay. And then you will have a small little spanner. It's, it says here 11 millimeters spanner and a large one like this so in total you have we will receive three separate tools okay all right let's put it aside for now we can put the output jack back in the cotton box and let's remove the main uh, harness from the packaging So when you receive the harness, the pre-wired solderless harness, uh, please check that everything is in place. When you push pull, when you push push, sorry, everything works and just turn the knob to make sure that it's not stiff or stuck. If there's any problems, please message us and we'll get back to you as soon as, okay? Free rolling and the five way switch it's moving across all the levers five positions without any problems okay so I'm going to show you now how to disassemble this uh, pre-wired harness from the little mounting plexiglass here so that you can put them on your new pickguard okay okay so first of all we will remove the pots. For this, we'll use the big spanner. Okay. Okay, turn counterclockwise. Just a small turn. And you may be able to remove the nuts and the washer and put them aside. Okay. And then go ahead and remove the push push pots uh, washer and bolt All right. and then you're going to use the small little spanner the 11 millimeter one for this so what, how you do it is you just push it all the way down and unbolt it slowly come out just be patient yeah you got to be flush to the plate for it to turn out all right there 
you go. Okay, so once you put them out, it's free to come off. And just be careful, there's some black washers on the bottom here. Okay, and lastly, we, we will uh, unscrew the uh, selector switch. Using this micro screwdriver that's provided. I remember not to drop the screws because they're really small. And pop the cap off like that. There you go. Okay. So the last step is for this um, washer, threaded washer. So we're going to use the big one now. And just slowly remove that. It should come right off. Okay. It has a washer itself also. And like that. Okay. So to put it back onto the um, pig guard, just do the reverse. Okay. So I'm going to show you now how to put it back in. So put this reducer back on. Assuming now this is your pig guard. All right. Okay, clockwise to tighten. Just a little bit will do. Okay, so this is facing the top all right okay now let's put the switch okay. line the holes oops because these things are really small you gotta be really careful with it Finger tight, not too tight. You pop the selector switch uh, cap back on. There you go. Okay, now let's put them back. Make sure the washers are in place. The black washers are for the pots, and they like to come off easily. Okay. Just put them, slide them on, and you're done. There you go. See? Just make sure everything's in place. And this one here, when you actually um, attach it to your pick guard, you gotta take off the double sided adhesive side to stick it on. Okay? Alright, so what we do is now turn it around. And if you recall, you gotta put the washers back on. Okay, so use the big one for the pots. Just a slight tightening will do. You can do a final tightening later on.
that's it. Okay, and last but not least again, this is how you attach the wire. So supposedly you have a wire. So what you do is you just use a micro uh, flat uh, minus screwdriver, just press, slot it all the way in and remove. Okay. Yeah. Sometimes it will slide in. And the weight the way to check it is it, it's not going to pull out okay and to remove it if you made a mistake just press it down again and remove the wire okay so I hope that helps it's really easy thank you and see you again